the notion of action and agency entertained by mr chubb and others from the inquiry into freedom of the will part four section two by jonathan edwards this is a librivox recording all librivox recordings are in the public domain for more information or to volunteer please visit librivox dot org so that according to their notion of the act considered with regard to its consequences these following things are all essential to it viz that it should be necessary and not necessary that it should be from a cause and no cause that it should be the fruit of choice and design and not the fruit of choice and design that it should be the beginning of motion or exertion, and yet consequent on previous exertion. That it should be before it is, that it should spring immediately out of indifference and equilibrium, and yet be the effect of preponderation. That it should be self-originated, and also have its original from something else. That it is what the mind causes itself, of its own will, and can produce or prevent according to its choice or pleasure and yet what the mind has no power to prevent precluding all previous choice in the affair so that an act according to their metaphysical notion of it is something of which there is no idea if some learned philosopher who had been abroad in giving an account of the curious observations he had made in his travels should say he had been in tierra del fuego and there had seen an animal which he calls by a certain name that begat and brought forth itself and yet had a sire and dam distinct from itself that it had an appetite and was hungry before it had a being that his master who led him and governed him at his pleasure was always governed by him and driven by him where he pleased that when he moved he always took a step before the first step that he went with his head first and yet always went tail foremost and this though he had neither head nor tail it would be no impudence at all to tell such a traveller though a learned man that he himself had no idea of such an animal as he gave an account of and never had nor never would have end of the notion of action and agency entertained by mr chubb and others from the inquiry into the freedom of the will part four section two by jonathan edwards